Hey guys, how's everyone? Kitty Cat is back to uh, to do your follow-up reading for the day. And let's see what spirit guides and guardian angels and the Father up above and the Divine Mother Universe wants to say to us, my soul tribes, because we are all evolving and learning on this journey. So before everything else, let's cleanse our space and call spirit guides. Thank you. Calling on my spirit guides, my guardian angel, the assistance of the higher power and the spirit of the universe as we're going to channel messages, possible energies, advice for twin flame, soulmate, love connection, today, tomorrow, timeless for whoever needs to hear this message. Thank you, spirit guides. Thank you, guardian angels. Guys, it's been uh, a year of my... Uh, anniversary for my awakening one year to be exact okay because august of last year i think that i had my dark night of the soul last year and by september i was out of it i guess end end of september i found my light i don't know that was so quick guys but i bounced out of it and i i'm going to share to everyone that faith can truly truly move mountains because before my awakening, I'm already saying my prayers and I was already connecting through meditation and reflection to, to the divine. Even if whatever the journey is, if anyone okay, is going to ask me what are the universe signs, the number signs, guys, I'm going to tell you the truth. During my awakening, I have seen so much numbers, 1111, 333. So, so wherever who is not awakened, do not even ask them because they don't know what to tell you. They would not know what to tell you. They were just telling, they would just thought you're very strange. You know, like last year, I don't know, guys, even on 333 everywhere. Okay, everywhere I go and 1111 anywhere. So anyway, I just wanted to tell everyone if you are awakening. Just know that that this is real. This is real and welcome to the journey. Anyways, guys, thank you for that intro. And today, because I want to use the cat tarot because this is what I felt called to use today. And spirit guides, we're going to use the cat tarot today, the kitty tarot. So anyways, guys, um, just want to uh, tell you that um, I did my live message today by the lake at Central Park. So thank you guys for uh, waiting and supporting my channel and uh, live messages, okay? Because if you're new to my channel, I ch channel the messages and downloads before touching tarot, okay? And then that's how we confirm confirm with my guides with my spirit guides if what my downloads are real that's the reason why for the last seven months i was working so hard because i was trying to understand and evolve on this spiritual journey and trying to understand what is the twin flame and soulmate soulmate journey so if you're new to my channel okay what is a twin flame what is a soulmate we are learning okay we are learning because whatever the case whatever the title and that's what i was saying to everyone whatever the title okay just know that we are manifesting our true love and happily ever after so anyways guys that's what it is that's what it is and i think on this journey we are trying to find our light we're trying to find our wings and we're trying to learn forgiveness compassion unconditional love because this twin flame journey guys for anyone who's manifesting their true love and happily ever after i don't know guys i tell you it's possible but but the journey is <laughs> guys the journey is very very tough okay i'm just going to say that tough love but guys so that's um, that's you know some twin flames never make it to happily ever after but some do okay but that's what i'm saying guys this is where my channel is all about this is the reason why i am power manifesting because twin flame or not twin flame 
it could be high level soulmate it doesn't matter guys it's soulmate okay we are manifesting and calling the soulmate in our life for a true love happily ever after it doesn't matter what the title guys this is what we are after so spirit guides thank you very much and thank you for finding me in the dark thank you divine thank you mother universe higher power and guardian angel for find finding me in the dark last year last year september last year thank you let's go follow up message for today please spirit guys follow up message for today please Bam! soulmate soulmate connection and judgment guys someone from your past that definitely this is what i was uh channeling already it feels like spirit guys trying to tell us a journey to the past present and the future and you know what the six of cup means is memories okay someone you've connected to from the past lives or it could be your twin flame it could be your soulmate guys um you are one soul in two bodies you are always going to be a part of each other regardless of this journey but guys this journey is not easy okay but spirit guys trying to say there will be judgment there will be judgment day or this could be the energy of victory and success victory and success and that's what i was saying this morning if you haven't watched my life okay guys sometimes the judgment is an angel an angel guardian angel the angel of destiny holding a flute but we since we are using the kitty i'm just telling you the truth because this morning i am already calling guardian angels okay i was channeling Whew. guardian angel okay for new beginning victory success which is also judgment victory and success and justice so six of cups guys someone from your past and this is what I was channeling exactly this morning. New beginning. There you go, guys. To see is to believe. One minute in the door. I'm already here. Soulmate, someone from your past. But whatever the journey is, there will be victory and success. And new beginning because the sun will shine. The sun will shine. Leap of faith. Keep going. Whatever you're manifesting, you're manifesting for a new beginning. To, to find your true love and happily ever after guys let go of the past it's done it's done whatever is meant to be it will be okay but this is exactly what i was saying this morning guys and nothing is made up i'm channeling and shuffling right in front of you only spirit guys can do this only spirit guys bam empress bam right in front of you guys bam empress turn pain into power turned pain into power the emperor came this morning i saw the emperor and then right now guys the empress is here and what did i say today guys that we might see the angels the angels sometimes on the judgment is the angel holding a flute but like i said we are holding a kitty that's okay guys but there is the egyptian angst angst is also an, a symbol of good luck okay victory success and the sun is here okay the full i said that this morning guys what we're going to see and the empress to see is to believe victory success new beginning turn pain into power empress emperor energy and soulmates and soulmates and strength spirit guys trying to say on this journey on this journey be strong be strong whether you already connected with your twin flame your soulmate, wherever journey you are right now. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Open new doors for new beginning. And be strong. Courage. Be brave. Be brave. Strength is also the energy of love and marriage. Love and marriage. Okay? So anyways, guys. Look, we pulled five energies and how, how many duplicates that I already said this morning that I channeled? One, the fool, the angel, okay? Because this is the angel with the flute in other decks. And empress, we're already talking about the empress and the emperor this morning. And look, guys, be strong, be strong. Thank you, spirit guides. Thank you, spirit guides. 
the tower because spiritual transformation but i always say guys that we're going to get out of the dark and look guys healing four of swords someone need to heal whatever whatever's going to happen guys that's the reason why my spirit has already advanced that whatever we're going through right now this is a calling of the universe that something is not right maybe you're going through the darkness right now or the tower moment but guys if you're awakening if you're already awakened you don't fear anything because you already found the light and whatever you're going through okay you will get through it because remember bam, spirit guys is already saying there will be judgment day there will be victory and success and love and the light will conquer the darkness so all you have to do guys look the kitty is i don't know what he's doing guys but the four of swords is like someone is guilty or someone is uh it's kind of like laying down but couldn't sleep but that's exactly what the energy is but guys something is not right if something is not right look you know what to do you know what to do and look there's some sadness there is some sadness in this journey i don't know guys but look but there is love offer of love king of cups is here king of cups someone who's capable of loving someone so whatever whatever whoever is in the and knight of wands look guys he's coming king of cups so anyways guys what i could understand if you're going to resonate with this message keep going be strong move to a new direction there will be victory and success success ahead and remember guys we have been channeling okay new beginning and the empress and there will be a bright future the sun is going to shine so so and and the darkness will end the darkness will end all this this darkness in here the sadness the guilt the anxieties the confusion guys you just have to believe and have faith because whatever guys whatever whatever you're manifesting okay if if it did not come true or or you or you are still waiting spirit guys trying to say keep going keep going in your journey and never give up never ever give up because somewhere along the way you will find your true love and happily ever after the king of cups and guys this is also a duplicate duplicate energy from this morning if you haven't watched my live reading this morning guys you have to watch and i have been channeling already the knight of wands the chariot the eight of wands because this is who is coming in your life so spirit guys trying to say be strong whoever you are whoever you are who's going to resonate with this message you will find your true love and happily ever after be step into your power as the empress because you will attract your emperor you will attract your emperor Bam! new beginning and future there you go guys that's it that's it because whatever's going to happen, there will be a bright future ahead. Ace of Wands, follow your dreams, follow your passion, be creative. You, like you will be successful in whatever you want to do, whether it's love, career, or in your life in general. There is a bright future ahead. The sun will shine. There is a bright future ahead. Keep going, keep going. So anyways, guys, let's... Um, it's beautiful so um spirit guys can we have our uh, channeled messages please this is beautiful guys i mean oh nothing in life is perfect but spirit guys trying to say pam take action because why the ace of wands ace of wands it and the knight of wands is an energy that you need to take action that there will be success so if something is not right in your life spirit guys trying to say take action and move away from things that doesn't serve your highest good and keep going because there will be a bright future ahead and the promise of the universe is trying to tell you soulmate will come 
and find you, okay? Your true love and happily ever after. Someone you've connected to in the past, regardless if it's a twin flame or a high-level soulmate connection, it doesn't matter, or your true love and happily ever after. There will be judgment day. There will be victory and success and justice in your life. So all you have to do is keep going and be strong and take action and take action because someone's going to come in your life, Knight of Wands, very soon. The, a person who's going to love you, King of Cups, King, Queen of Cups energy. And the lesson of this journey is step into your power as the Empress or the Emperor and turn pain into power. Turn pain into power. Look, guys, start again. Start anew. Begin again. New beginning. There you go, guys. Take action. Move forward. Move forward. Whatever, whatever the pain, whatever the struggle, whatever the past, it's time to start anew and begin again. Bon voyage, guys. Bon voyage because welcome to the journey. And look, find the middle ground compromise because you are an awakened soul. And it feels like this is a tower as well, guys, or Excalibur. It feels like a sword or a tower or a lighthouse because it feels it's a lighthouse, guys. You found the light. Find your middle ground because you're in the middle between 3D and 5D. When I say 3D, Earth, okay, and 5D, spiritual awakening. But we are awakened souls, okay? I mean, whoever's resonating with me, if you're already awakened and you are in the journey, Spirit is trying to say, find your middle ground, find your middle ground and compromise and keep going, okay? Keep going, keep going. Ascend your soul to love always high vibration because this is the journey of the awakened souls always ascend your soul to love ascension okay which is also the very strong energy lesson from the lion gates 88 lion gates portal anyways guys whoever's going to say that this journey is not real well you're low vibrational and you're not awakened but for whoever are the awakened souls divine feminine divine masculine you will know my truth because this is real this is real and unfortunately this is real okay this is very real and look on your awakening your third eye vision is always is going to open too because this is the universe a gift okay uh, that you can see beyond the veil you can see beyond the veil and also a gift, guys, that you will find yourself. What is your calling? What is your life purpose? If your life purpose is to be a seer, a healer, or whatever your, whatever your life purpose is, but it's to guide others, to find their light, to guide others, to find themselves, and to guide others to vibrate to love, light, and peace. This is what the journey is all about, guys. I mean, bam, that's it. Okay. And finding guardian angel and spirit guys and in strengthening our faith look guys emotional challenges i tell you because in this spiritual journey it's going to take you to the darkest in the darkest moment of your life and some emotional challenges but you have to uh you have to embrace the change guys and and really tell your spirit guides and guardian angels and pray to the divine that you don't want to stay in the dark because the only one that could save you is the light from the divine and connecting with your soul tribes with the right soul tribes who is and who are in the highest in the highest vibration trying to shed light and truth and peace to you so whoever is um like ask you know if you if you're awakening and you want to to understand in this journey do not seek advice to people who are not awakened because they will just give you not the best advice at all because you know guys unawakened never know about this journey okay unawakened souls low vibrational souls only on, they only um look for the earthly you know what guys what what how do i even say this okay because the earth is full of pride and ego and materialistic it's kind of like they only look for the gain okay earthly gain they don't do not they do not vibrate to 
to whatever is outside of of the earth or it's spiritual so anyways guys i'm just trying to say that if you're awakening and if you're trying to seek advice uh seek the advice of the awakened souls just like you okay your spiritual guides so high vibrational high vibrational only that's what you need okay to get out of the dark to get out of the dark bam true love happily ever after true love happily ever after there you go guys eternal union divine divine love divine union because spirit guys trying to say whatever the challenges you will find your true love happily ever after there you go guys two of cups energy whatever the challenges is this awakening you are manifesting your true love happily ever after who's also who's going to be high vibrational i tell you guys because spirit is trying to say whatever the journey is someone is going to come in your life king of cups emperor energy which we saw the energy this morning and look guys keep going keep going and i also mentioned on my life this morning that be with someone who make you see the beauty of life because this is exactly what it is guys because you, when you are awakening you're trying to strengthen your light frequency to heal yourself to heal others and to heal the planet and i know it's much more deeper guys but you know it's saying here living light energy because you have the light inside you and you never give up you keep going you never give up your light to the dark so the more like i said this morning guys the more you have blockages in your life that's a calling that the universe is trying to tell you either you're being attacked by the dark forces because they're trying to quench your light they're trying to stop you from healing yourself healing others and and healing the planet because that's your life purpose and life mission okay so if you are experiencing all these blockages it could be the test from the universe how far your faith will go or it could be the dark forces trying to quench your light so anyways guys i am telling you the truth because every awakened soul every awakened soul has to go through emotional challenges in the dark night of the soul to be where we are right now but whatever the case guys this is my channel is all about manifesting manifesting true love and happily ever after trying to start anew and begin again and and leap of faith leap into the unknown and turn pain into power turn pain into power and never give up that's exactly what my guys want to say and i'm sorry guys i need to come closer because i need to shuffle so guys look this is the journey true love happily ever after this is what the journey is all about when you're awakening take care of your light because you will be blessed guys the universe is going to navigate you towards the best direction for your true love, health, happiness, and abundance, okay? And your life purpose. So anyways, that's beautiful. <clears throat> Look, guys, meditation. Meditation for every awakened souls out there. And if you are listening to me right now, let meditation be your lifestyle. Take care of your health physically, emotionally, mentally, spiritually. I know this journey can be very challenging and trying, but Spirit Guy is trying to say, hold on, hold on, keep going and meditate, meditate and trust the universe. That's how you can do, guys. Trust the universe, trust the divine, trust the process, whatever the journey is, even if you don't understand like i do guys I, I never i did not understand but guys you know i was crying before but but i was just trying to say father if it's your will thy will be done because no matter what through the storm through the wind the hail whatever the lowest and the lowest ever the darkest i have been there guys that's why i've been praying i have been praying whatever your faith is guys you have to believe, believe that the divine and someone up there is going to guide you in this journey. Bam! True love happily ever after. There you go, guys. I cannot believe this, guys. Look, 
Bam! Two of Cups, true love, happily ever after. There you go, guys. Take care of your health. Take care of yourself. Self-care, cleanse your energies. Or if you're awakening, meditation, reflection, keep going, guys. You have to be mentally, emotionally, spiritually, physically stable, okay? At the same time, you, have, you need to learn to trust the divine. Trust the process, okay? Because there's no one else who's going to help you but the divine themselves, your guardian angel, your spirit guides. And if you are manifesting for your true love happily ever after, it will come. That's why I keep saying your emperor, your empress, your true love happily ever after, the one for you is going to come in your life. And look guys, your light, do not let the dark quench your light. Always have hope, always have hope. So it feels like, guys, the um, what I'm channeling here, guys, is like have faith because faith can move mountains. Have hope, have strength, and have courage that your true love and happily ever after is going to come in your life. And that's that's the moral story in here, guys. And let's let's get two more, okay? Let's get two more, and that's it. I don't know. I feel cold. And look, guys, proposal possibly marry, marriage, engagement in the future, or could be love and marriage because we already have it, guys. True love, engagement, proposal, and work on yourself. That, that's what it is. If something is not right, keep going. I mean, that's, that's uh, what spirit guys want everyone to know. Keep going. Let me get one more, guys. Look, the butterfly is the it's new beginning. When you embrace transformation, new beginning, okay? Look, call spirit guides because spirit guides is going to get you out of the darkness. Possible travel? Huh, guys, possible travel? It could be you and your soulmate are already connect connecting on the 5D or a possibility that someone is, go is going to travel. Maybe you're going to travel to see each other who knows guys maybe you maybe your future life partner doesn't live in the same city as you so anyways guys it could be anything okay or it could be just maybe spirit is trying to say take take it easy take a break and um see new places okay just take it easy but anyways guys anything is possible so we are trying here. We are trying. But for whatever the case, you have to be strong. You have to be strong. Spirit, guys, I don't know if I need to take that. I let, guys, I'm going to take it, okay? Because the others was just falling. And connect with high vibrational people. That's what it is. And trustworthy people. There are many layers and dimensions to the situation or person you're asking about. So this is the energy, guys. That's the reason why they're saying that there are a lot, there are many layers of people around you. Or maybe, I don't know, guys, something I could channel. I was already saying a while ago that if you are awakening, you have to ask someone or people around you who are vibrational, who are good and great and wonderful spiritual guides, okay, to guide you. Because if you're awakening and you're going to ask others what, what, what's happening to you, they'll just they'll just tell you guys pop a pill or something and and go to the doctor because no one would understand guys. But anyways, guys, the divine has already opened the doors for us, and spirit guys and the divine is trying to tell you be confident, be confident because look. The divine is trying to shine their light on you. So anyways, guys, special message. Self-confidence through God confidence. Believe in yourself by believing in God working through you. So whatever is the journey, guys, that's what I was saying. Believe in God because the divine, the divine in the end is going to have the judgment in this journey. Okay, you have to keep going. And what did I say, guys? Divine life purpose. Because on your awakening, it all goes back to this. Find and pray for divine intervention and help and, and ask for help so you can make this journey, okay? And, and whatever your life is, guys, to, whether you're going to meet your true love happily ever after or your soulmate and your career, but still, guys, 
here vibrating and still pointing towards your divine life purpose because as an awakened soul your purpose is as i said already vibrate to love to heal yourself others and the planet <laughs> anyways guys trust the signs and your inner guidance which are leading you to fulfillment so when you're awakening that's what i was saying a while ago guys what are the 11 11 what are the synchronicities and the repeated numbers, the repeated messages, your dreams that you've been seeing? That's part of spiritual awakening that because that's the universe and guardian angels trying to tell you that you are truly awakening, that your alarm clock, oh my gosh, guys, has been buzzing, okay? Because it's the calling of the universe for you to awaken. And that's beautiful. All you have to do, guys, is say yes. Okay, say yes and why what is the purpose of spiritual awakening there you go guys divine life purpose to vibrate to love to guide others to find their light and help you find your wings so you can also guide others to find their wings and find their light through the help of spirit guides and the divine okay guys and how will you find the light and how will you get out of the dark and negative situation by embracing change by letting go of things, people, places that no longer serve your highest good, clearing away what no longer serves you in this journey, period. That's it, guys. So anyways, um, anyways, guys, look, forgiveness. That's what exactly I was saying, guys. Part of the lesson of this journey, spiritual journey, whether it's twin flame, it's soulmate, or you're just spiritual awakening, forgiveness, learn forgiveness. Forgive yourself. You've done nothing wrong. Archangel Michael, I ask that you help us let go of self-blame and forgive ourselves. Please guide us in releasing any toxic anger or fear towards others. Thank you, Archangel Michael, for allowing us to feel centered and at peace. So guys, I know it's easier to say than to do, but we all have to forgive we are we all have to learn forgiveness and unconditional love at some point so guys <clears throat> whatever this journey is going to teach us that's how it is guys forgiveness compassion and you created what is it says you created the situation you have the power to change it keep going and look guys pray to the divine faith faith guys that's how it is so anyways Oh my goodness, welcome to the journey guys. You created the situation and you have the power to change it. Thank you for letting me lean on your strength and for reminding me of my personal power. Please guide me in to manifest and heal according to divine will, creating peace and blessings for everyone involved. Anyways guys, Spirit Guys is trying to say that whatever happened in our journey, we have to turn pain into our, to turn pain into power and realize that there is an emperor and empress deep inside you and what you are going to do you need to heal and power manifest your goals and wishes and dreams into reality so guys look and be peaceful and wait for blessings to come in your life but anyways guys we are creating and working and doing and praying for our blessings in our life so anyways guys look prayer forgive yourself you've done nothing wrong and you have the power to change your life okay you have the power to weave your own destiny but you need to have faith okay and you have to call divine intervention you you need to start praying guys look prayer will help the situation prayer will help the situation why do you think we are praying every day why do you think i'm sharing my prayers when i am going to ch to church anyways guys we say our prayers whether we're inside the church or not but faith faith should be in our heart because like i'm always channeling even since this morning or ever ever since from seven months ago guys I always have faith because faith can move mountains just like love and light okay so anyways prayer will help the situation Dear God and Archangel Michael and anyone else to whom you pray, such as Jesus, guys, like 
as you all know okay i also post whenever i say my prayers to jesus divine mercy sacred heart of jesus but anyways guys jesus is one of our ascended master our savior okay who's who's going to send healing light and healing miracle and divine mercy to us to help us in this journey so anyways guys call jesus call the father up above call this the divine mother universe and the angels anyways guys let's read the prayer we ask for your divine intervention exactly what i was saying guys to help us in this journey spirit guys guardian angel father up above we welcome your help and we trust and follow your guidance with gratitude and grace we need a miracle and ask that you send one to us and this situation quickly thank you and amen guys exactly what we are doing we believe in divine intervention we believe in the healing light from the divine up above we believe in divine guidance and we believe in divine miracle that it will come true that it will manifest our dreams to reality our goals our wishes our true love happily ever after our abundance okay whatever you're manifesting and also good health so guys believe believe trust and have faith and that's how it is guys welcome to the journey and i'm not going to do live channeled message to tomorrow guys but i'm going to bring the energies i'm still going to do this tomorrow okay so thank you so much guys have a good night bye